Hey guys, I wanted to uh, bring you a video on next week's um, playoff games. It's going to be an interesting one. The schedule just came out after the um, Raiders winning against the Chargers. So Saturday you got the Raiders versus Bengals. Um, the Raiders would have to travel to Cincinnati. Uh, earlier in the season, the Bengals beat uh, Las Vegas in Las Vegas. So... I think the Bengals would probably win this game. Um, I got them favorite on that one. But I think it could be a little bit closer if um, the Vegas Raiders can control and slow down um, the offense in that sense. Uh, next on Saturday would be the Bills and Pats. And actually, that's going to be, I think it's going to be a good match. Um, the division game. Pats are uh, kind of struggling down the road, um, and then the Bills, um, I think, getting hot at the right time. So this time it's at um, the Bills' home game stadium. I think the Bills should be able to pull this one out. I think it's going to be a lot closer, um, unless, the, just like the first game, unless it's really bad weather that does not favor the Bills, because I feel like um, they don't really have a rain game. The Patriots do have somewhat of a running game and could help with that sense. Um, and that kind of helps put uh, Josh Allen in one-dimensional mode. But that's where I think he ha if it's really bad weather, you really have to not throw. They should learn from what happened last time. And uh, it, it's kind of interesting, like I said, um, how the Patriots are down the line, uh, down the road, kind of struggling. So next... Uh, you got the Eagles versus Tampa Bay. Um, and, and so far, like I said, I don't have really any upsets. Um, now, Eagles versus Tampa Bay, I think Tampa Bay should be able to win this game. It's it's at their home. They play a lot better at home. Um, but I think the Eagles um, should play better than their first time. Even though it was a close game last time uh, towards the end, I just think... Uh, Hertz is going to use this experience and everything, kind of build that um, locker room and build that uh, environment and culture uh, with the Eagles so they can have a bright future and build upon this uh, win. Um, it, it's not like a team that just went under 500 and got in. Next, even though the Niners had to uh, win it in overtime in, uh, in a thrilling way, you would say, I would say, and that was a big comeback too. And I feel like stuff like that, there's two ways you could look at it. Is it going to take so much emotion and uh, drain you? Especially you have to travel. It's not at least all the way East Coast, but um, Central. And this is actually pretty, like I said, I think this could be, the be this could potentially have the best game for that week. And I think Cardinals and Rams and Bills and um, Patriots. I, I feel like those are the three games I, I would say I want to watch because those three has the potential to be a great uh, finish and game. Uh, the Niners and Dallas Cowboys have not played in the playoffs since 1994. So like I said, growing up, I remember watching the Niners and Cowboys going back and forth, um, going to trying to get to the Super Bowl. So it kind of brings back those memories. It's going to be, I, I think, going to be very exciting to watch. Um, and brings back the memories of uh, Joe Montana, Steve Young, and stuff like that. And tomorrow's, uh, or today, actually, as you watch this video, it's going to be the catch of the Dwight Clark and Joe Montana. So um, anniversary. So... It's going to be very uh, interesting. I, it's a lot of big names, I feel like, uh, on both sides, on offense. Um, especially, I think Cowboys have a pretty good defense, too. But I'm going to choose the Niners. And this is actually the closest. I'm, I'm looking at the early uh, lines. This is um, minus 3.5 for Dallas. So, Dallas is favorite. But not by much compared to to the other games. Um, the Rams are favorite also, um, but at the same amount, minus three and a half. So I just remember that one year where the Niners went to the Super Bowl and 
they beat Seattle at the last uh, second with that touchdown. So it, re it reminds me, you you have to get really hot at the right time. And sometimes got to be lucky on who you draw. And so there was one scenario where the Niners could have drew against Tampa Bay, and I, I, I knew they could not beat Tampa, Tampa in that scenario. So I'm really glad of everybody that you could draw. I want either Dallas, Cardinals, or the Rams at the time. Uh, would have been my preference on the draw. So to be able to draw Dallas is nice and then have a scenario because, like I said, if the Eagles are eliminated and the Niners win and pull that upset, they will have to play the Packers in the next round, which, like I said, earlier in the regular season, the Niners did leave too much time for Aaron Rodgers. So I feel like that could be a revenge game, and that's going to be an interesting game too. So the Niners, I think a lot of teams um, and fans uh, did not want the Niners to get in in that sense. If you're trying to get to the Super Bowl for the NFC, you want that easier route. And I think the Saints, they they were, the Saints were going to be one and done. There's no way they were going to, just like the Eagles, I don't see how the Eagles could pull an upset. So, and that's why I said the, a lot of teams did not want to face the Niners if they got in. So... I think the Cowboys are not looking forward to this. This is going to be either way a really rough and tough game. Um, and then next, you got the Steelers and the Chiefs. I mean, it's nice that uh, Big Ben is going to have his final playoff game on his final season, potentially. But Chiefs should easily win this game, especially it's in Arrowhead. So uh, then the final game of the night, it's Monday on ESPN, I believe, Cardinals and Rams. Like I said earlier, the Rams are only favored by um, three and a half. They split during the regular season, so it's really hard to win so many times. So I would say this game is going to be interesting, um, but I'm going to say the way both teams played today, the Cardinals losing, and then the way Rams won or, or lost, I feel like the Rams had more fight and potential to win this game. They just looked better uh, down the stretch than the Cardinals. Even though Stafford is struggling, I, I feel like. Because he struggled. I had him in my uh, two out of my three fantasy football teams, and he struggled down the stretch for me. So let me know what you think. Um, definitely Week 18 was a great one. Uh, looking forward to next week. Like I said, I think... As long as, also another thing I want uh, to throw out, if the Niners could get some more healthy players, like Trent Williams, for sure, because you're going to have Michael Parsons. You're going to, it's going to be very um, tough to deal with. And I don't know if Diggs is going to be back by then. So it's going to be interesting, like I said. Uh, that I, I think that could be the game of the week uh, next week. Next with... I would say Cardinals and Rams, that could be a good one, and Bills and Pats. Those are my three uh, that I think could be, because I don't see anyone really choosing Vegas, uh, Las Vegas Raiders, um, who else is there, Tampa Bay, or um, the Eagles, sorry, or the Steelers to pull the upset, so... Uh, let me know what you think in the comment, who do you think is going to win next week? Uh, put it in the comment section. Let's debate about it. Prove me wrong. Or do you think I'm crazy? I know a lot of Cowboys fans are going to think I'm crazy for this. But uh, like I said, I mean, if you a Cowboys fan, do you think, uh, th I mean, were you excited to hear that you're pl playing against the Niners when you could have faced, like, where you could have faced Cardinals, potentially? Um or I don't think you could have faced... Uh, yeah, you had a chance to face the Eagles. So, I mean, I think Dallas, well, how they trash Eagles, they probably would have wanted the Eagles again. So, um, and as a Niners fan, were you excited um, to draw Dallas compared to, like, the other scenarios I threw out? Like, because they could have ended up playing Tampa, which I don't think you wanted that. Um the Raiders, are you glad just to be in? Bengals, I mean, yeah, there, there's a lot of great matchups, I think, this 
upcoming week. So uh, go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And thank you for all uh, 400 subscribers. Uh, we just passed that. So I do appreciate all the love and support um, for helping out. And together we can build a better tomorrow. Thanks.